Good evening. How are you? Hello. Good evening. How was your day? Hello. Hello. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> how are you, teacher? Good. And you? I'm fine. Thank. An easy day. A difficult day. Um. Eh, how do you say productive? Productive day. <laughs> Un día productivo. Productive. A productive day. A productive day. Yes. Many. Good. Hey, good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Luis. Nice to meet you. There are some days that are easy, some days that are difficult, some days that you say, yes, I accomplished a lot. Yes, it's true. <laughs> Good. Okay. Well, it's great to have you guys. I see everybody's coming in little by little. Blanca, how are you? How was your day, Blanca? Oh. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How was your day, Blanca? Uh, excuse me. How was your day, Blanca? Uh, uh, Can you hear me, Blanca? I have problem in the in the audio teacher. Okay, no problem. No problem, Blanca. It's okay. Ah. Hey, look, we have a, a, a new one. Clim, clima, climaco, is that right? Or is it climaso? It's delicious. Delicious. Or is cool. it Climaco. Climaco. It's Climaco, <laughs> right? Climaco Guillermo. Yes. Climaco, can you hear me? What is Climaco? Or is Climaco or cool? I'm not uh, sure. But what is Climaco? Last name. What do you think, Luis? What's that name? La Climaco. Oh, Cli okay. no, clim Climaco. <laughs> Climaco. Climaco. Okay. The letter <laughs> I has a accent. Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah, but, you're right. You're right. Yeah, Climaco. Uh -huh. uh -huh, Climaco. No Climaco. Uh -huh. No Climaco. Yeah, Climaco. <laughs> Yeah, it's in the stress of that letter. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But I think maybe he, he cannot speak because with nothing, no noise, no sound, nothing. Carla, are you okay? Yes. Do you feel better? Are, have you recovered? Yes. Yes, I'm good. Okay, great, great. Pedro, how about you? How are you doing? Hello, teacher. <laughs> Hello, Pedro. And in this moment, in the uh, the um, with the family and to the mini mini series Netflix. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's time. Yeah, you have to spend time with the family. It's good. <laughs> yes. But in the moment to break because I I, I, I have the class. <laughs> <laughs> Which series? Pedro? Which is the series? The name of the series. The city. Uh-huh. The name. 
Ah, uh, the name is uh, the, uh -huh. the mother only have, there are only B2. There are mother only two. <laughs> okay. In Spanish, madre solo hay dos. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> yeah, because it's a, uh, uh, my wife prefer this kind of series. I, I prefer doing that. <laughs> wow. Well, we are How do you say in English, teacher? <laughs> Una que cría y la otra que pare. I'm sorry, Luis. How do you say in English what? <laughs> one uh, one woman uh, to cria y la another one uh, pare. Do, do you know? <laughs> in Spanish. Yeah, the Paris. <laughs> yeah, in Spanish is an uh, uh, parir is pare, right? Pare. Pero de parir, uh -huh, de tener un baby. Has, she has a, a little born, a baby. Yeah. The, the, so, yeah, the, 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 this parir is really is just a. Uh, she had a baby. It's just the word had. Had. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Uh -huh. And the people understand because in the moment you say baby, the person understand what is the action. It's kind of okay. like, a, it, it's like, a, is, for example, if I say red, mm -hmm. you understand it's a color. Yeah. It's not necessary to say the color red, but in Spanish, no. we say the color red. But when I say red, blue, green, do you uh -huh. don't you don't think another thing. You don't think, oh, a tree or a, a bird. But in Spanish, yeah. we say the color red. So the same for the bird. Only yeah, it, you say the baby, ah, it's automatic. Yeah. Had a baby. Yeah. And if it's, in Spanish, it's more specific the language. <laughs> we have a lot of words. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. Little <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> All right. So what, what yeah. we're going to do is today we're going to begin with reviewing a little bit about the comparisons with adjectives and with nouns. If you remember, yesterday we learned a little bit about adjectives and nouns. And we saw specifically the idea for how to use them. So here, let me share my screen to make sure that we remember, okay? Yeah. We can see from yesterday, we, we learned the words for comparison structures, like more than, less than, better than, worse than, as, as, and not as. Remember, those are antonyms of each other. So more, the antonym is less. Better, the antonym is worse. As, as, the antonym is not as. The difference in meaning is as, as. It means the same. So uh, I am as old as Luis is the same age. Or I am not as old as Luis. It's, we are not the same age. So as as is the same. Not as as is not the same. And the others are self-explanatory for more or better or less at worse. Uh, Blanca, can you hear me? Is dip, I think you need headphones, Blanca. The problem is probably for, for the headphones to, to hear better. Yes. Mm -hmm. But the idea is we're gonna practice with our partners and we're going to do the, the two forms. So as an example, uh, I say, a lawyer has more education than a mechanic. And then my partner changes and puts the opposite, the, the opposite way to say it. So my partner says, oh, a mechanic has less education than a lawyer. Another example. A mechanic has better hours than a lawyer. Then we put in the opposite with the same meaning. Uh, a lawyer has worse hours than a mechanic. Okay, so we want to use those and we want to go back and forth with our partner. We want to say the, the same meaning that our partner said using different words. Is that okay? Are there any questions? 
No, only the practice teacher. Yeah, that's the idea. Okay. okay. We're going to go with our partners and we're going to practice. Remember, it's the opposite. Um, let me see. It was Climacal, Climaco. Climaco, can, can you speak? Do you have audio or no? Yeah, I have the audio. Okay, perfect. That way I make sure I put you, uh, if not, I, I put you in a different group. But all right, yeah. let's create what I see and let's practice. Good evening, teacher. And how are you? Hi, Weber. Hi, teacher. Hello, hello. <laughs> Sorry, but I don't know what we had to do. <laughs> I just joined to the to the class. About a minute. <laughs> George, you want to explain? Teacher, I, I join later in the class. <laughs> okay. So we yesterday we were looking at and we learned a little bit about the comparisons. Okay. Mm -hmm. So hang on. The less and better. Yesterday we learned the comparison structures. So mm. with your partners, you're going to make the sentences with using different words. As an example, if Rebe says a lawyer has more education than a mechanic. George, you are going to make the same sentence, but with different words. So mm -hmm. you would say a mechanic has less education than a lawyer. Is the same meaning, but a different form. Mm -hmm. Then the same for you, Rev. If George says a mechanic has better hours than a lawyer, the same using different words is a lawyer has worse hours than a mechanic mm -hmm. okay okay i got it it's okay yes okay yes, I got it. I Mm. Invest uh, more time that they do, uh, that working as a doctor and the hospital. In, invest more hours, the doctor. They know the or, nursery. Uh -huh. Other example could be a doctor. I work as a doctor is better paid than work as a nurse. Uh huh. Working is a doctor. Yeah. Earth, more money. No, um, it's no. better paid. Ah, it's better the same. Pay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Better pay that, that working as a nurse. Mm -hmm. it's, it's moving. It's moving. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, actress more is the, the difficult. Eh, in, 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 in nurse, in number six is, is nurse. She is nur. Yes. Nurse. 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 <laughs> Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Um, for um, photo photograph. Como, photograph. How do you say photograph, teacher? Photographer. What photography mm -hmm. is the difficult uh, 
uh, in the in the artist. Difficult the working that that difficult. Yes, teacher. Uh, difficult, Andres. Say again, Heidi. Um, uh, Blanca say the photo photograph is more difficult than photo as a actress. Okay, so. Photographer is more difficult than an actress. The actress. The mm -hmm. act. uh, and the act, actress. And then the, the actress. opposite? What is the opposite, Haiti? And the opposite is working the actress is, is less difficult than working the that work in the photograph. Photographer. What? That's good, but it's photographer. Okay. Good. Okay. Uh, mechanic. Mechanic. In is, is, a, no, more is the difficulty in uh, in the in the work, uh, a doctor has more responsibility than than a, uh, um, than a secretary. A doctor has more uh, has more responsibility. Than a secretary. Okay, a secretary less responsibility than a doctor. Very good. That's uh, good. That's correct. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Carla, did you have difficulties? Sorry, teacher. <laughs> Make, uh, my internet is 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 down, so I'm out. I understand. Yes, yeah, I. Yeah, sorry. No, no problem, no problem. I see it's a little difficult at this moment for you. Yes, but yes. I I don't I don't see that the message with um join in another another group, but. Because I I get up mm -hmm. and go to the kitchen, so I don't see that. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. I if you want, I we try again. I send you to another group. Let's try. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Thank you. You're welcome. Yes. Okay. Yes, yes. Yes. Okay. Um, working. Okay. And the opposite is working as better is better work, working the working as pilot. As pilot. Okay. 
eh, ahí sería, um, excuse me, eh, working, working the eh, pile yes. is, eh, is the periodists. No, eh, tiene que añadir si es más o es, o es más difícil. More, more. Ok. Ah, ok. Eh, Pailos, eh, more is eh, the, the difficult eh, eh, in the is less working in the periods. No. No, 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 no. The example, maybe the pilot is working that pilot is better than working as period. That's correct. Yes, Es correcto, ok. Uy. Blanca. Um, Blanca. Yes. Look in the chat. Teacher. Look in the chat. Ah, ok, ok. That way it helps you. Thank you, teacher. Ok, working. Ok. Working. Work, working as a pil, pilot is better than, than working as a journalist. Right. Only I, I spelled incorrectly uh, Dan. I, I spelled incorrectly Dan. It's T-H-A-N. Um, I, I correct. Working. Okay. Working oh. as. Oh, aquí uh, working has working as a layer is a vital than working as a, a artist say again blanca Yes. Repeat. Yes, working, work, working, working as a journalist is worse than, than, than working as a pilot. Mm -hmm. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Yes. The uh, question, teacher. Qu question. Working. As, eh, lo uno esto o lo puedo pronunciar separado working as correct that's correct working as ok ok hoy le toca ID ok Any questions? No, any question, teacher. It's okay. Okay. Now we're going to practice using them. You practice making them. Now we're going to practice with the exercises. Remember, the idea is when you begin with the gerund, you begin with the activity, right? Working as a pilot reading books, uh, uh, these types of activities you can put at the beginning and that helps you, okay? Also, when you have a profession and you use a noun, for example, a doctor has worse hours than a pilot, I don't know. 
or an engineer has uh, ha makes less money than a doctor. So always is when you compare, you need to put the word than, but the than goes after the adjective. With our partners, we are going to practice, okay? And we are going to go to the exercise where we can practice. This is 2.8 in the platform. So in the platform is 2.8 and it's a knowledge check. Here is the example. For As an example, we have an interior decorator, a fashion designer, and we have to use the word paid, which is correct. An interior decorator is paid bad, uh, is better paid than, better paid than, or better paid than. So is obvious is is because we need the verb to be. We need to have the description. So the best answer is the first plus. With your partner, you are going to do numbers one, two, three, and four. When you finish one, two, three, and four, we're going to continue. And we're going to practice the listening. For the listening, it's you and your partners have a summer job. Here, you listen to the video, okay, and then discuss it. Now, it's important. So, we are going to do the knowledge check. And then with our partners, we're going to listen to the video and discuss what is in the video. What do we understand? What are the these summer jobs that they're describing? What do they do? Okay. Any questions? No, teacher. No, no teacher. It's okay. No, any question. Okay. Is there anybody that has difficulty to, to would you like me to explain or it's okay how to make the comparisons? It's a little difficult, but it's only the practice uh, for to um, let's practice. No memorize things. No memorize the structure. It's only uh, to have in the memory and the pronunciation normal using this structure. Okay. Yeah. Well, let's practice and let's see. Okay. Hello, Carla. Hello, again. <laughs> Here is the computer, the screen. Okay. Do you look my screen? Yes. Okay. But the first is the 2.8. Uh, I'm sorry, but uh, Pedro in, in me, um, there is him. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm feeling right now then. Okay. Here is the exercise. Is uh, to re review again the, this information for Carla. Okay. Do you look? Do you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Here is the exercise. The number one is that travels more than. Number two. Nice to meet you. And the t-shirt too, right? Hello. <laughs> 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 okay, I don't know you how open the platform because we, we need a result of the exercise. Uh -huh. The number one is, let me check, it, compare, what number? the number one is what number? Uh, 2A, 2A, uh -huh. damn it there. Oh. Oh, two ten, no two ten. Teacher, is two ten right, teacher? The exercise, huh? The exercise is two point ten, correct. Two two point ten. Two point ten. Yeah. But the first is is necessary to listen the, the video. Yeah. 
But and the then is... we we will respond the 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 answer we have above. So you are going uh, to do two point eight, and then two point ten. Two point ten. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Thank you, Peach. You're welcome. Okay, and then number 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 point ten, the first. Okay. Some girls. <clears throat> okay. Uh, then my version. Point, point, uh, 2.8, the exercise. Eight. 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 2.8. Okay. No, it's shake. Uh -huh. It's about the... Number one. Com number one. Yeah, number one, the, the, com the comparison uh, uh, secret A and... Versus a, police, uh -huh, versus a police officer, officer and um, okay, more, uh, more uh -huh. travel more, then uh -huh. travel, travel stand. Mm -hmm. And for What? me, I think this the travel more than. Yeah, for me too. Okay. Hey, Juana, what do you think? Mm, me neither. Ah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My phone. Okay. And this one. Guillermo, you listen. No, I can listen. I don't listen to. Ah. Ah, so what can we do? <laughs> you didn't listen to anything. No, when you share, when, when you share, uh -huh. you have the option. It has to, you have to share audio, not only video. Ah, okay. It close it and try again. Uh -huh. And when you share, it's going to give you a little box and it says share audio or, or share cell phone audio or something. And you have to say yes. Mm -hmm. And now? No, no. Close on the chair and so close it and then share again and see if it gives you the option. So stop sharing. No stop sharing and then try again. Okay. Try again and okay. what you do is going to give you the option for sharing audio. What about now? I don't listen. Nothing. No. I I tried. Mm -hmm. And did you finish the 2.8? Huh? Did you finish the exercise 2.8? Yeah. Okay. I already finished. Excellent. It's my own hours. As long as I work eight hours a day, I can come in at any time from 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. Lucky you. Paul, did you find a summer job yet? Yeah, I'm working in a restaurant. Oh, how's it going? Oh, the money's not bad. What are you doing? Are you waiting tables? I wish. 
No, I'm working in the kitchen. I cut up stuff for the chef. Vegetables and meat and things. I also wash the dishes. Oh, yuck. Yeah, it's pretty hard work. I didn't realize how hot it is in a restaurant kitchen until I took this job. So why don't you quit? I'd love to, but I need the money. So what kind of job did you find for the summer? I'm working for a marketing company. I'm doing telephone marketing. Oh, so you're one of those people who drives me crazy by calling me up and trying to persuade me to buy something that I have absolutely no need for. Exactly. Do you like it? Believe it or not, I do. It's mostly a bunch of students working there, and we have a lot of fun when we're not making calls. It's really easy, too, since we just have to read from a script. Are you doing this full-time? Yeah, but I work from 2 in the afternoon until 11 at night, so I get to sleep as late as I want to in the morning. Okay. Okay. No. What kind of jobs? And the number one, what kind of jobs are Carlos do? Um, do you want to listen again? Tutor, or? tutor for kids. Tutor for kids. Okay. What kind of, that's Julia. Julia uh, works in a company. Telemarketing agent. Telemarketing, telemarketing agent. Okay. And what kind of job does Paul do? Chef assistant. Chef mm -hmm. assistant, yes. Who doesn't like what? Hmm. Paul doesn't like. <laughs> uh -huh. Because, but he needs the money, say. Wow. Yes. Okay. Are you waiting for you for uh, complete your sentence? For me, with to put um, to to time for understand the in the pronunciation or in the vocabulary and and you is a uh, imagine to review only only that only one in the moment. Okay. It's a good, it's a good movie. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know it's a, I am crazy? <laughs> but I like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no sé. individual. Individual, si gustas. Individual. Pero right? se van a ir todos. No, I don't know if you have a micro. Okay. Okay. Living Mexicano. Okay. And, and you? Teacher, I finished and, and, and the lesson um, too. Okay. And what was the audio about? What was the jobs about? Summer job. Summer job? Uh huh. What jobs do they describe? He's a, a telemarketing agent, chef, tutor for kids, and chess chef assistant. assistant. Now, what do you understand is the concept, George, for so much job for summer jobs? What does that mean? Does what, what when they say, "Oh, this is a summer job"? What what do you think that means? A 
is like a like a job that is during a month or a few months. That's right, Reven. That's right. It's like in El Salvador when we say a uh, Christmas job. It's only for uh -huh. one, it's only for one or two months. It's only for a season. It's only for the season, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Season. Here is the summer job because in the United States, <laughs> the, the students stop working in May. So normally the summer job is May, June, July, sometimes August, which is the time where is more uh, more activities because everybody's on vacation. Like in El Salvador, it's common that in December is a lot of activity, so they have Christmas jobs. Were there any questions for 2.8 or 2.10? No. No. No? Okay, let's try some examples. Hey, Rebe, can you give me an example with comparison? And then, uh, uh, what is it? Uh, Climaco is going to give you the, the opposite. Okay, let me think. Climaco, right? Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, let me see. <laughs> okay. uh, I don't know. I, I forget all the, the profession. <laughs> Can I give one? To start. Okay. Yeah. Um, work as a teacher is more stressful than work as a comedian. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty good. Remember that you need to put ing, working. Uh, working. Yeah. Yeah. Working. And working mm -hmm. as a comedian. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. And what is the opposite way to say that? Uh, being a comedian is happier than being a, a teacher. Okay. <laughs> pretty good. Pretty good. Uh -huh. okay. Great. So there are no questions, right? No. Okay. Let's go back to our groups then. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, before we continue, are there any questions for lesson two? For comparatives, for nouns or adjectives or any words? No? No, 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 teacher, no, about that, that conversation. Okay. Is there another question or, or, or something else? No, in my case, I don't have a question. No? Okay. No teacher. Okay. Great. So now we're going to be taking a look at, we're going to be beginning our unit three. In unit three, we're looking at favors. Do you know what are favor? Asking for favors and doing favors. Do you know what are favors? Favor is helps someone. That's good, Luis. Exactly. When uh -huh, when someone help another person or person. Yeah, that's a favor. Uh, the idea of favor is when you help someone or when you uh, make a request or you help somebody with a request, right? That's the idea of the favor. That's gonna be our unit three. That's where we're gonna start with, with could you do me a favor? So we're gonna begin by listening. What is the favor and what happens in the conversation, okay? So listen to the, uh, to the video. What is the favor? and what happens 
Okay. Very cool. I'm so glad you're home. I was wondering if you could help me out. Yeah. I need a big favor. My boss just called and he wants me to go out of town this afternoon to meet with a client. That's great. Yeah, but my parents are out of town too. And my little sister Megan is staying with me. Would you mind if she stayed with you tonight? I could pick her up tomorrow by 10. Uh, no, I don't mind at all. Uh, what time did you want to bring her over? How about now? <laughs> Hi, Megan. Did you want to spend the night here? Okay. Great, uh, but I have a report to work on tonight. Don't worry, we planned ahead. She brought her homework. She'll keep herself busy. Fantastic. I, I have to run. Thanks a million. Oh, you're welcome. Bye, Meg. Have fun, but do your homework, okay? Don't worry, Ann. I will. <laughs> What are you in, Megan? Eighth. Hey, you've got the Twilight movies. Can we watch them? Uh, sure, but I think you should do your homework first. Okay. Good. Uh, you can work in here. I have some work to do, too, so I'm going to go to my office. Okay. the homework coming? Good. I did half of my math problems. That's good, but you still have some more work to do. You can watch the movie when you're done, okay? Rachel! Yes? I'm done. Is it okay if I watch the movie now? Yes! <laughs> Turn down the volume. Oh. Thank you. I'm starving. Can I have something to eat? Uh, it's only four in the afternoon. So? Um, okay, how about some carrot sticks and an apple? What else have you got? I have some strawberries and whipped cream. Anything else? Okay, how about a pizza? I have one in the freezer. Plain? I think it's a veggie pizza? That sounds good. I know. It's so romantic when Edward tells her he loves her. Does he stay with her? You mean you've never read any of the books or seen the movies? No, I was too little. But I'm old enough to understand them now. Can we watch the second movie after this one's over? I have a better idea. <laughs> Anybody home? Oh, good morning. Morning. What's going on here? We stayed up late reading Twilight. I loved it when Bella first dreamed of uh, Edward. Oh, me too. The part where Jacob appears? Wow. We must have lost track of time. We ought to get going, Megan. All right, I'll grab my stuff. These books are the best. Would you mind if I borrowed this one? Oh, no, go ahead. Thanks. You two really seem to hit it off. How'd you do it? I guess a good book can still bring people together. Okay, so let's go through it, okay? What is the favor at the beginning? Let's start with that first favor. 
before we talk about all of the things that happen? What's the first favor that is asked? And the uh, first favor is a taking care of Megan. Uh, it's a favor in, with the neighborhood. Um, in, 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 in this moment, but then, um, and that to be continued, they asked uh, Megan to do homework and, and not make noise with the movie and in the favor to to down the the balloon for the movie. Okay, excellent, excellent, Pedro. That's right. They asked for a lot of favors. The first one is to take care, right? Take care of Megan. That's the first one. But then they also ask other favors. Uh, for example the favor to turn on the volume of the movie, the favor to have something to eat, uh, to do the homework. You're right, they do a lot of different favors or they ask for a lot of different favors. Now, when we ask for favors, it depends the, the formality. Um, we can make favors with different forms, okay? We can have less formal and that our friends or family to more formal. These are the ones that we usually have that are professionals. Um, in your WhatsApp group, it's also the, this slide, this information is also in the WhatsApp. But here we can see that from less formal is very common to use the word can and could. And then very formal or more formal, we would have a, would it, the woods, would it be okay? Would you mind, okay? These are the, like in the medium, not, not informal, but not very formal. And the last part is the very formal ones. This is the one where you usually begin with I. I wonder if, I was wondering if, I, this is normally when you have the I is the one that is more formal, okay? So can and could, uh, less formal. Uh, would, uh, the intermediate, and then finally, the eyes are the very formal, okay? No problem. So when we ask for a favor is we ask for something, like something small can be a favor. Luis, can I borrow your pencil? Ah, eh, Blanca, could you, could you lend me your phone, okay? These are small favors, maybe to write, to make a phone call. Then we have a little bit medium, medium. Uh, this is, would you mind, right? Or do you mind? Uh, would you mind if, if I have a, if, if you give me a ride? Or would you mind, if, you know, if, would you mind if I stay uh, uh, for an hour? A little bit more formal. And probably the biggest ones are when we talk about mm, money, we talk about promotions or jobs or for different activities at work. This is normally, I was wondering if I could, I was wondering if um, there was an opportunity for a new position, okay? These are a little bit more formal. So uh, just making sure that we are clear Okay, the favors can be from can, could, all the way to I wonder. And all of those are in between. Now, are there any questions? What are these requests? When we do, uh, when we ask for favors, how do we make them? So let's read them, okay? Um, there are interference. There's interference. Yes. Yes, I don't hear clearly. Okay, okay. Let's try. Who would like to read these? And maybe that, that will help. Okay. Of the beginning. Anna, can you try, can you read the list, Anna? The questions? The beginning. From there, yes. Okay. Can I borrow your pencil? Could you lend me a jacket? It is okay if I use it, your phone. 
Do you mind if I use your CD burner? It's not this, exists, I think so. Now, will, no. <laughs> will, it, be, <laughs> will it be okay if I pick up it up on Friday night? Would you mind if I borrow your digital camera? Would you mind letting me use your laptop? If wonder if I could borrow some money. I was wondering if you mind letting me your car. It's excellent. Okay. Now here we have two very common words that we that people confuse. We have the word borrow. Can I borrow your pencil? And we have lend. Could you lend me a jacket? What is the difference between borrow and lend? Does anybody know the difference? Is, mm -hmm. Borrow is when some somebody else asks me something. Okay. So no. we're done. Mm -hmm. And lend? When the people uh, give me one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's the when I ask something. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. When I borrow when is when I I give me one. Yes. Okay, so let me, it's good, that's good ideas. So if you want to buy a house, if you want to buy a car, you have to have money. Normally you go to the bank, uh, Banco Agricola, Cuscatlan, Scotia Bank, and you get money to buy the house. You get money to buy the car. This is where you, you, you can use both, both are correct. The difference is who gives the money and who receives the money. So, for example, Banco Agricola gives me the money, right? So, I go to Banco Agricola. Can I borrow the money? Okay. Can I borrow? I receive the money. Now, Banco Agricola gives the money. Can you lend me the money? So when the person lends is, is their property. When you use borrow is not my property. So can I borrow money? Is not my money. Can you because lend I don't have. money is your property? Borrow is when I don't have. Correct. Lend is, is one is mine. No, no, no. Lend is when the property is the other person. So, for example, this phone, okay? The phone. You want to use the phone. You say, can I borrow? Because you receive the phone, okay? Because the phone is in, it's not mine, it's your. Correct. And the, the always is mine, always the phone is mine. The difference is the focus. For example, Anna says, can I borrow the phone? Because you request, you receive. Mm -hmm. Now, can you lend me the phone? Is you, I do the action, I give to you. So one is Anna, mm -hmm. the other is I give. Borrow is take and use. So borrow is when you receive. Lend is when the person gives. Banco Agricola, yeah. Banco Agricola money. lends you money because Banco Agricola gives to you. You borrow money because you receive the money from Banco Agricola. The intention of returning. The what? George? But is for the example, uh, return or the, the phone, but he, he, no, but is my phone, I can, I can say, I lend you my phone. I lend me 
If it's your phone, yeah. yeah. Correct. If it's your phone, okay. I lend you my phone. Yes. I understand is uh, take a phone and use and return it. You see in the WhatsApp group, the, the difference between borrow and lend is in the WhatsApp group. You can see also. Okay. So when you borrow something, you receive it. When you lend something, you give something to somebody. So I want okay. to use Luis's, I don't know, Luis's computer. Luis, can I borrow? I receive from Luis. Luis, can you lend? Luis gives to me. The two is the same. The two, the computer is for Luis. The two, I receive the computer. The difference is focus who does the action. I do the action, I borrow or focus Luis. Luis lends, Luis does the action. This is the difference. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But maybe when someone has something, for example, uh, Anna said, Anna, Anna has a, a, the telephone, she is lend, she is lend, but I don't have a, a telephone, I am borrowed. Because uh -huh. I, mm -hmm. Correct, because uh -huh. you, have to, you have to ask Anna, because Anna has yeah. the telephone. Anna borrowed me the telephone, uh, Anna lent me the telephone. <laughs> the correct is, uh -huh. Anna lent me the telephone, not Anna borrow me the telephone, uh -huh. because you do not have a telephone. You yeah, receive, I don't have a telephone. You, you borrow the mm -hmm. telephone. I receive. Uh -huh. When you I give, it's, it's lame because if I request, it's borrow. Correct. If you request, it's borrow. If the other person give to you, it's lend. But you can ask, Anna, can you lend me? It's a request. Mm -hmm. But no, I do the action. You do the action. Mm hmm Okay. okay, interesting. Okay, we're going to pause there, and that is the topic for tomorrow. Remember, advance in the platform, advance today already in unit three. In unit three, the exam is fast, and then you have the exam this weekend for unit yeah. three. Yes. Yeah. Okay? okay, all right, have a good night. I see you guys tomorrow. Thank you. See you. Uh, good night. Thank you. Good night, good night, good night teacher. Bye. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night.